Hello out there to all my YouTube followers. I want to start by saluting my Orula, which is always good because Orula is, you know, for us who practice Ifai, Orula is our what Jesus Christ is the Christianity. So I'm going to say a prayer and then I'll continue. Ago Orula, Ago Eleri, Ana Guardei, Odudu, Akakafuri, Tiku, Atikiti, Tiu, Tache, Baba, Ache, Yeye, Ache, Miuluo, Siwa, Yu, Ache, Baba, Barrio, Alabite, Beye, Kere, Tifun, Yumero, Ko, Iyo, Momoro, Sobo, Kofi, Indenu, Kinka, Mache, Miuluo, Siwa, Yu, Ache, Baba, Remi, Ache, Orula, Ache. Right here, what I have is, um, this is my little personal for me, and, um, this is just what I keep in 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 the house. This is uh my Eshu, my Legua, and uh my Guerreros, which I keep fresh fruits for them at all times. And then you see here these are coco. So when I need to talk with my ilegua or I have a situation going on or someone has a situation that's how I communicate with my ilegua and then what I have right here is water from the mountains for when I for my padrino he's a, he's an hijo de Ochun so that's very important for me and him even though I'm a son of Odua and this right here is liquid Osain and this right here is a very special remedy that I use for me and uh, personal stuff. But anyways, I just wanted to let all you know that I wanted to show you guys my situation here. I have other stuff, but it's uh, kind of confidential, you know. It's not good to expose all of what you have. But um, for all those who are interested out there... On learning the religion of Santeria and Ifa and or are interested in learning about the Orishas and little simple Ibos, Trabajos, please make contact with me. My information is on all my videos, babaileguasbotanica.com. My information is on there, my cell phone number. And my email address, or send me a spawn, uh, email via YouTube. And I will be sure to get back to you as soon as I can. And it is very important with your with your ilegua every Monday. Because ilegua is, without ilegua, there it's, you know, ilegua is the first. The same thing in voodoo, papa legba, you know. Papa Legba is the ruler of the crossroads. Ilegua is the ruler of the crossroads in Santeria. In Palo Mayombe, it's Lucero Viramundo, you know. So every Monday is his day, and I try to go out and give him a fresh cigar, some rum, you know, and my own special little treats. And my Jereros, these are very important things. This is They call this being half santo when you get this situation here. You are half initiated. Because you're, you already have poders, you already have powers, you already have the secretos, the secrets of Orisha, Ochosi, Ogun, Ilegua, Osun. Those are the Guerreros right there. And for me, I have Ifa, so I have Orula, because I, I study Ifa. But it doesn't mean you have to, you know, you don't have to have Orula if you want to become a Santero, you know. Some uh, say yes, you do. Some say no, it's whatever. But anyways, I see a lot of people that show their altars. And usually I have candles burning. But I had a prepared candle here. And it just finished today. And it burned. And this itself is, is a message. Burning black like this. This is itself is a message. I make all my candles prepared 100% by 100% beeswax that we have here on the farm. And, um, like I said, if any of you have any questions, do let me know. Ache for all you viewers out there, and for all those who are trying to learn the religion. <laughs>